closests to a 3D smash that I've ever seen, thanks to the Z-axis being uh -huh. how it is. Um, but enough of that crap. So yeah, sometimes to the <laughs> sometimes to the uh, negative effect of the overall gameplay. I'm sure. Mm. Yeah, Wind and Cornbread, Wind playing Krom and Cornbread playing Lucina. And this is like an interesting dynamic between these two characters, right? I think at the early meta game, people are very sure that Lucina is kind of you know the character, and then slowly but surely. You know, especially in the last few months, uh, Krom has been making some waves. Yeah, thanks to characters like, or people like Shoyo James. Um, and that's, that's like the most notable Krom that I can think of. Uh, Mr. R was doing pretty hot with, oh, yeah, uh, with some Krom, too. Mr. R, Mr. R. Um, and those are the only two that I can really think of. But, I mean, seriously, I mean, when you, you're basically Lucina with a slightly worse recovery. That is such a simplified way of saying yeah. Krom <laughs> is good. But, uh, uh, yeah, I know there's a lot more to Krom than, you know, just that. Uh, you got the up B out of shield, which is really strong, but I mean, Dolphin Slash is probably better anyway. And Cornbread looking pretty crispy so far. Got that forest match to take the first stock, mm. winning most of the neutral exchanges, and uh, we got a 50 50 right there, both of them hitting each other. Oh, man. Interesting whip. counter and neutral, man. <laughs> yeah, that was very interesting. I gotta turn this down. <laughs> yeah, I'm like killing my own air drums here. Nice uh, jab in the back here, it looked like. Yeah, both these players look like oh. they're... Oh, no, that's the unfortunate. And oh. that's kind of always that trump card that Krom has in play, the up special. You know, the recovery it also will send a lot of people just to their deaths. And if you're not paying attention in the edge guard, wow, that's a step back forward smash. That was a whiff punish if I've ever seen one. Oh a psychic God. whiff. When he set that up, he's like, oh, I know you're going to throw a forward there right here. He hit his pinky finger yeah. with that, dude. That was good. My sword's a little bit longer than yours in that situation. No hmm. problem. Man, that's awkward having a daughter. Jeez. <laughs> oh yeah, we got that. Uh, we got that uh, father-daughter uh, relationship going on right now, right? I love it when um, Lucina beats Krom. She's like, "Father, I won." <laughs> like, way to rub that in. Counter. Here we go. Yeah, yeah there that's it is, probably that a dead Krom. That's a dead Krom right there. Yeah. Just counter. Just to double check, but just that cleans sure. it up. Someone knows the matchup. Yeah. And that, that's something I learned from Smash Four when I was playing Ike Mirrors. It's just like, oh, you want an Ether? Okay. <laughs> I'll have to remember that, like, when I, uh, you know. Okay. I I'm playing a little bit of Marth myself. Oh, that's mine that you're uh, changing. Oh, I'm so sorry. That's all good. <laughs> da, 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 da. I'm two? Okay, cool. Don't worry, guys. We're working on production on the fly. All right, we're here there we with, go. Uh, CT Lux and Index. I'm going to turn mine back down just a little bit. Okay. We're, we're figuring it out. We're good. Okay. Can okay. you hear a scream? Are we good? I hope they can. Press hear. one if you feel bad for Index's ears. Having to listen to Lux. I mean, it's. Man. <laughs> I, I mean, you could just feel bad. For index, just for being index. Okay, so game three. Oh, game two, actually. Game two. Okay. Game, game three minus one. Game that's two. right. That's right. That's right. You know? Ooh, look hey, at everything this. is game three if you try hard enough, right? You just Th gotta win. Yeah. I, that was a very bright and philosophical <laughs> thing and profound. But so far, you know, like, this is like the interesting part. It seems like Cornbread has been just really capitalizing on the range difference between the two. And anything that. Wind would normally be able to throw out kind of to bully his opponents in most of the neutral situations against every character but Lucina. He's getting punished for it. It's true. It's true. But I do like how he adapted a little earlier. He he did a um, an air dodge to get back onto the stage as opposed to you know getting countered for right. you know for breathing. Yeah, um, you know the the elusive recovery. It's like oh. the first thing that the Croms have to learn. They'll survive. Yeah. They'll yeah, barely. Saved his double jump. Yeah. Hey, only those who go too far know how far they can truly go. So he's probably done that a few times in the training room. Uh, you know, to its uh, yeah. great effect or to its failure. Right. He's got an edge guard situation here. He's going to have to aether. There's the counter. There it is. And that should do it. Yeah. There it is. Man, that's just like free. <laughs> that's life. It, no, seriously, Lucina's edge guarding is generally insanely free. Right. Uh, just because of uh, her mobility in the air and Dolphin Slash being what it is. She can go really low, like a lot lower than you might initially think. Right. And I think some of the difficulty that Wind is having is, you know, in the neutral, you can see how much more mobile Cornbread is. But yeah. Wind doesn't, isn't playing the neutral as mobile. He's kind of just asserting and pressing buttons. He's jumping a lot and running into shield with aerials. Right. And he's getting caught a lot just for doing that. Uh, I don't really see, like, the cross-ups or anything like that to, you know, uh, make ambiguous movement a right. reality. And, and I think he's dead again. Oh, he backed up. Oh, Ooh. Cornbread got the down tilt instead. Did putting it on different. a clinic with the edge guards. Yeah, he did something a little different there. I like that. I like that a lot. 
Yeah, and Cornbread's really feeling himself right now. Okay. Yeah. Oh. He didn't overextend either. He waited for a response from Wind, and then he started slapping him up a bit yeah, more. Nah, it's just garbage time, and it's that's probably it. It's yeah, he, over. Yeah. Man. Oh, oh, he survived. Oh, okay. I thought he was going to get one more. Probably should have gone for the down tilt that time. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. But Cornbread's sitting pretty. Right. Uh, okay. And caught him with one too many dash dances that time, you know. Yeah. He only plays two mobile so long. Went super deep for that recovery and didn't make it back. Yeah. Again, only those who go too far know how far they can truly go. So, hashtag go too far. Go too far. I'll make sure to I'll make sure to <laughs> perpetuate that. And yeah. <laughs> yeah, let's see oh. if uh, Wind has a second wind in him and can make a little run of it. Putting in some damage. Oh man, if he picked up that forward air, he would have been in business, but he yeah. didn't unfortunately. Now he's off stage and yeah, good no. back here to clear out space just so he can recover. Ooh, a little impatient with that forward smash there. There we go, is that parry? Yeah, parry, you know, got the jabs out. Could have probably down tilted for a better recovery angle. Or a better watching angle, but a good forward go. air and Speaking of second wins, just on cue, here we go. Now we're in business. He's got the weather gauge on his back, a little momentum. He needs it. And they're both going to neutral air, as you can see. Oh, Cornbread's a little nervous. He's not playing that same mobility, free and easy game. Yeah. And now Corn, you know, it's like wind has caught up and kind of caught on to it. Yeah, he didn't go oh. for the tech chase when he had it. Got the back air. Is this it? There we go. Yeah. It's free. It's 100% free. Gratis. Cornbread looking uh, mighty tasty there. So we got some carne asada and we got some cornbread on the stream early. I had some cornbread <laughs> this morning. Did you really? It was very good. Nice. It was very good. I had a really big slice of it so I could embrace my gluttonous side. Got it. Nice. Which is yeah, what I do all the time. In the morning. Cornbread. In the morning. In the morning, it was chicken, cornbread, and green beans. <laughs> like 